Hey guys, Nick here. Uh, have you ever missed somebody? You ever like just genuinely missed them? They were gone for a while. About um, three weeks ago, my wife and kids took a trip back to my family in Missouri. They were gone for two weeks, and it's chaotic when they're there, and it's hard to have conversations and text messages are, are sparse and frankly by the end of that two weeks I just I really wanted to hang out with my wife and I just missed her and I just wanted to spend time with her and figure out how she was doing and and know her again because I felt like I had lost like knowing how she was doing <clears throat> this week we're talking about the spiritual discipline of silence and solitude and silence and solitude is spending time with God. It's, it's spending time only with God, where you put away other distractions like, like your phone or you know, the computer or um, other people even, and you, and you go and you're able to just spend time with God. And this is so important in our day and age because of all the distractions that we have. My phone tells me every time I have an email and a text message, and um, I have two young children whom I love, but they're vying for attention. It's hard to hear the voice of God in the midst of that. And when we participate, when we have silence and solitude, just spending time with God, we hear the quality of His voice. We get to know what His voice sounds like so that when it is difficult, we're, we're more readily able to recognize God's voice. And I love just spending time with God like it's it's a relationship that I need to invest in and, and pour into and having just alone time with the Lord is um, quite honestly it's something that I desire so I want it and the more that I'm a part of it the more that I want it 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 changes me sometimes I read his word sometimes I just pray sometimes I ask God how his day is going um, and I just want to hear from God. Um, I hope that you participate in this. Sometimes you think you have to go away. Like I went on a hike on Mount Rainier a couple weeks ago and had some solitude with the Lord. But it doesn't just, uh, it can't be um, just that, uh, something big or all day adventure. Um, the other day I went into my backyard and climbed up in my kid's treehouse because I was distracted with all the things in the house that I needed to do and I just wanted to spend some time with the Lord. And so I climbed up in my treehouse and, and hung out um, with God there. And, and that was some silence and solitude that I spent with the Lord. So I want to encourage you to be participating, to have silence and solitude, just to spend time with God. It's a wonderful relationship to cultivate. We all would probably agree with that. And so, and, in, and as we're a church that's ma about making disciples, um, I want to encourage you as leaders to encourage your group members to participating, uh, be participating in silence and solitude, to have a time that's where everything else is put away and it's just spending time with the Lord. If you've not done this before or recently, um, I really encourage you to do this. It, it, it will change how you connect with God. Love you guys. Hope this is encouraging. Go make disciples this week.